next on HBO. If you're curious about Madonna, here's the intimate look you've been waiting for. The HBO premiere of Madonna, Truth or Dare. Stay where it happened. HBO. HBO First Look. It's your close-up. All right. Your exclusive first look at the making of the movies that you want to see. You're in luck. Before they hit the theater. If I'm bald, I have to get more money. Where else could you be this inside? Take this takeover again and I'll tell the truth, huh? It could only happen here. HBO, please. HBO First Look. Simply the best behind the scenes in the business. Just the best. I know. It's great. HBO First Look. Only on HBO. HBO can't spend all its time discovering comedians. Why did you want to leave me? Because I can't trust myself. We've got to rediscover some, too. He was a much, much better comedian than he was a wild empire. <laughs> your money or your life. I'm thinking it over. HBO remembers a comic virtuoso. Jack Benny. Comedy in blue. Premieres Monday, October 5th, only on HBO. Wouldn't it be funny if my next show was lousy? He's political. She's politically incorrect. And just when things are heating up on the road to the White House, her past catches up to his future. From Republicans, Democrats, even communists, she's figured out a way to lose them all in one fell swoop. Love and politics mix in the HBO original movie, Running Mates, a romantic comedy starring Diane Keaton and Ed Harris. It's really a love story. The film is, is really about these two complete opposites who, you know, re-meet after many years. You remember yeah. Huey? You. Mm. You Hathaway? Oh. Senator You Hathaway? Captain of the football team. Oh. <laughs> I, I guess I didn't make much of an impression on you. Oh, no, well, we didn't really actually know each other in school, Senator. You can call me Hugh. Well, I've been keeping up on you. I've read all your books. Oh, is that right? Children's books are required reading in the Senate now, huh? <laughs> Fall in love and, and all the problems that ensue out of the fact that they are so completely different. Well, could you even try and be a little charming? Charming? Mm -hmm. Sure. Well, hi! Hi, it's so good to see you. I'm Aggie Snow. Good. When you're acting... I think you always want to uh, have something to dig your teeth into, and I think the fact that she's so contradictory continually, <laughs> it's, it's really fun to play. Are you fertile? Yes, I... Oh, God, I think so. But we just thought it might be nice for the American public to have some hope of a White House baby. That's all. Oh, well, I'll certainly try to lie back and think of them at that time. She's smart. She's funny. She's attractive as hell. I'm crazy about her, Gordy. She's the one. He's pretty much kind of a cool guy, and he's he loves it. You know, falls in love with this woman. He's got a good sense of humor, and it's it's like a Tracy Hepburn kind of thing. I am not your husband yet. There, there. That's exactly no. what I'm talking. About. No. No, 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 no. That little slip tells a whole story. I meant to say you're not my wife. That's all. The truth is, you're envious of my position. Oh, is that what you think? Well, that is just so totally absurd. I can't even yeah, reply. Yeah. Maybe you'd like to wear these tonight. Ah! Oh, okay. Okay. Fine. Fine. I love Ed Harris. Okay, I can't help it. This, I think he's just the most remarkable actor. And I really wanted to work with Diane because I've always liked to work. She's a wonderful person. She's a total joy to work with. A, a director is only as good as his actors. And so in this case, I have to be very good. Although the script for Running Mates was written several years ago, there's a political twist to the story that could be right out of today's headlines. Is there any potential scandal in your background that we should know of? Oh, no, I don't think so. Did you appear nude? Is there sex in the film? Does Ms. Snow appear nude in this film? Uh, Senator, this is not going to go away, and the press has the right to know everything about this film. I think the story has some relevance in the sense that um, 
somebody could inadvertently um, cause a scandal by having done something in their past that that seems harmless now, but is actually could really hurt somebody. And I, I think that we've seen that a lot. I've pursued one goal my entire life, and in one swift move, you may have blown my whole dream apart. Look, I realize that the presidency is the mucky-muck job in the oh, solar system, oh, but I have a career that's in jeopardy now, too, and that doesn't seem to concern what you What the hell at are all. you talking about? The home box office was sort of interested in doing something, and I thought, God, it would be so great to do this, because for me, this part is so much fun. But at the moment, HBO is doing uh, adventurous things. Yeah. Senator, he just loves it when I tie him up to a chair, strip down to holster and heels, and blow I Gotta Be Me on his bugle. Diane Keaton and Ed Harris star in the HBO original movie, Running Mates. Premiering Sunday, October 4th at 8 p.m. on HBO. If it's a subject families need to talk about, but it's hard to talk about, HBO for Family will deal with it head on. Life stories, families in crisis. You are not pushing him into another class. You are not pushing him into another school. These true life dramas are based on real events. Joey DiPaolo has the HIV virus that can cause AIDS. They confront issues facing every family in America today. I don't even know how much it's going to cost. I mean, the abortion, getting there, the Becky, bus, I have these money. They're provocative. What's supposed to happen to me if you die? They're honest. We want to talk to you about your problem. They're about real people sharing the most painful moment in their lives so you can make the right choices in yours. We just want you to get help. I'm scared. They could have told their story anywhere. They chose to tell it here. Life Stories. Families in Crisis premieres Tuesday, October 13th, only on HBO. Watch it with your kids. The spotlight is on some of your favorite comedians as we take a look at what's at the box office in this weekend's HBO Movie Guide. Here he comes, Mr. Saturday Night. Billy Crystal stars in Mr. Saturday Night, a look back at the life of stand-up comic Buddy Young Jr. Stan, you got one minute. Oh, jeez. See you later. The story follows Buddy's 50-year comic career, from his parents' living room in Brooklyn to the top of his profession. Don't get me To the twilight of his career. Along the way, we learn about Buddy's love-hate relationship with his manager and brother, Stan, played by David Paymer. Okay, I'm ready. Hi! And we take a look at his lifelong love affair with his wife, Elaine, played by Julie Warner. There was something about him that I felt uh, a kinship with. I liked the machinery of him. I liked the pit bull quality of him. And uh, I wanted to play him. Mr. Saturday Night is also Billy Crystal's directorial debut. It's rated R. Hey. I love father. I love father. Another of comedy's brightest light stars in Serafina, a powerful story about South African students and their extraordinary teacher, Mary, played by Whoopi Goldberg. Through song, dance, and inspiration, Mary gives these children the courage to change a world filled with social and political injustice. I want them to know where they come from. I want them to have a sense of pride in themselves. Black pride. If you will. In her first movie role, native South African Leilati Kamali plays the young Serafina. What do you want? Freedom. Serafina is based on the Broadway play of the same name. It's rated PG-13. Wind is drama on the high seas during the America's Cup Challenge. Matthew Modine stars as world-class helmsman Will Parker, who cost the United States the cup for the first time in history. His dream is to win it back. Will begins by tracking down his former lover and longtime sailing partner, Kate Bass, played by Jennifer Grey. So tails I stay, heads I go. Okay. Together, they mount a campaign to win back sailing's highest honor. It's bit of work, Will Parker. Uh, the experience of making this movie and the, and the kind of people that I met during the course of filming um, really affected my life. Wind is rated PG-13. Woody Allen's newest film, Husbands and Wives, is the story of two couples who must reevaluate marriage, friendship, fidelity, trust, and love. The movie stars Judy Davis and Liam Neeson, Mia Farrow, Juliette Lewis, and of course, Woody Allen. Woody plays a college professor who falls for one of his students. Is your whole family stormy and tempestuous? I didn't know I was stormy and tempestuous. Husbands and Wives is rated R. 
next on HBO. If you're curious about Madonna, here's the intimate look you've been waiting for. The HBO premiere of Madonna, Truth or Dare. Stay where it happened. HBO. Next, from the crypt. Another mature woman, but they do give a man something special, don't they? The murder, madness, and mayhem continues. Oh. May our passion last forever. Want a little more champagne? Oh, don't you get it? They want you. None but the lonely hearts. <laughs> Tales from the crypt. Premieres Wednesday night at 10. <laughs> HBO's Thursday Night Prime is a place for love. I like sex. What else do you like? A place for magic. The woman practices witchcraft. Someone has cursed you. A place for murder most foul. What can we do to stop her? It's too late. People are dead. She's a black magic woman who's got a spell over HBO's Thursday Night Prime, where the action is. Premieres Thursday night at 9 on HBO. For the biggest movies, it's HBO again. How far back are you? 1948. What do you see? He stabbed her in the throat. Roman? Someone wants to kill me. Those are just dreams. He found you again. You were in the house. This is exactly what happened with Roman and Margaret. I'm not Roman! I loved my wife. You still killed her. Dead again. Premiere Saturday night at 8, only on HBO. Boxing means champions. Boxing means tradition. Boxing means HBO. Terrible Terry Norris, the WBC super welterweight champ. Is he the best fighter pound for pound? Just ask Leonard, Curry, and Taylor. Now it's up to Simon Brown. Simon says, put up or shut up. Norris versus Brown, pound for pound. And there's only one place to see it. You know where it happens. Norris versus Brown for the super welterweight crown. Live Saturday night at 10 on HBO. HBO. If you're curious about Madonna, here's the intimate look you've been waiting for. The HBO premiere of Madonna, Truth or Dare. Stay where it happened. HBO. She's articulate. She's honest. The only thing that I could remember about the entire four years we were together was every night in bed doing this. What are you doing? It's the only thing that stuck in my mind. She's real honest. There was one guy I remember I was in bed with him. He kept on saying to me, tell me what you want. Tell me what you want. Tell me what you want. Uh, I want a milkshake. What do you think I want? Susie Essman tells it like it is in her very own One Night Stand, tonight on HBO. The HBO original movie starring Diane Keaton and Ed Harris. Did you ever have your IQ test? Well, of course. How high did you score? Yours, plus 12. <laughs> Falling in love is like running for president. Until the outcome is clear, you're either a fool... I hate politics. ...a visionary... She's the one. ...or both. You can try and be a little charming. Charming? Mm -hmm. Sure. Hi! Running Mates, a romantic comedy for the election year. Premieres Sunday, October 4th on HBO. HBO, the only place you'll see it. Larry the Liquidator found the steal of a lifetime. It's called a corporate takeover. Except stealings against the law. So what's it gonna be? Sue? Gotcha. Settle? You lie! Don't leave, we haven't talked about sex yet! Mm -hmm. Penelope Ann Miller. Everybody on Wall Street's gonna know some broad did you win. Danny DeVito. It's so perfect for me. Other People's Money premieres Saturday, October 3rd only on HBO. The critics are raving. The ratings are great. With HBO's comedy hits Dream On and The Larry Sanders Show, we've got the best hour on TV. Huge rolling in the aisle left. <laughs> the New York Post said with these two series, HBO has established itself as the place for adult comedy. We're going to go blind and, and grow hair on our palms. So while the other guys have been dragging out their retreads, HBO's been here all along with the freshest comedy around. And why stop when we're on a roll? There's plenty more in store this fall with brand new episodes of the best hour on TV. Can I hear you say, hey now. Hey now.
So get wise to these guys, Marty and Larry. The two of you, as a team, you're fabulous. Every Saturday from 10 to 11, it's the funniest hour of television anywhere on television. Dream on Saturdays at 10. The Larry Sanders Show, starring Gary Shandling, Saturdays at 10.30. Works for me. Two great guys, one great hour. It could only happen on HBO. Tonight, it all happens here on HBO. At 8, it's a provocative look at one of today's hottest stars, Madonna, Truth or Dare. And at 10, the laughs are on the house. It's One Night Stand, Susie Essman. Then at 10.30, watch one union boss's rise to power through corruption in the HBO original Teamster Boss, the Jackie Presser story. Madonna, One Night Stand, and Teamster Boss, the Jackie Presser story. It could only happen here, tonight on HBO. The following movie is rated R.